Hello friends, I am Nisan Katira and today we are going to learn chapter number 8, Coordinate Geometry. Friends, in earlier videos, we had studied question number 1 and 2 of exercise 8.1. Now in this video, we will study question number 3. Question 3 is using a distance formula so that point A, B and C are collinear points. Now, what do you mean by col collinear points? Collinear points mean the points lying on the same line. So, how can we find? So, first of all, we will have to find the distance between these three points and then we will decide that these points are collinear points. Here, three points are A, B, and C. As you know that 2 is called x coordinate and 3 is called y coordinate. So, x1 is equal to 2 and y1 is equal to 3. In the same way, x2 is equal to 4 and y2 is equal to 7 and x3 is equal to 0 and y3 is equal to minus 1. Now in this sum, we will have to find the distance between these three points. So we will do three sums. First we will find distance between A and B, then B and C and then A and C. So AB square is equal to x1 minus x2 square plus y1 minus y2 square. Now distance between B and C, so BC square is equal to x2 minus x3 square plus y2 minus y3 square. Now distance between a and c, so ac square is equal to x1 minus x3 square plus y1 minus y3 square. Now let us put the value in this formula value of x1 2 x2 is 4 whole bracket square y1 is 3 and y2 is 7 whole bracket square 2 minus 4 minus 2 square and 3 minus 7 minus 4 square square of minus 2 is plus 4 and square of minus 4 is plus 16 ab square is equal to 20. Now, we cannot directly find the root of 20. So, we will make part of 20 which are 4 5s. Root of 4 is 2 and root of 5 is under root 5. So, AB is equal to 2 root 5. Now, BC square value of x2 is 4 and x3 is 0, y2 is 7 minus y3 is minus 1, 4 minus 0, 4, minus minus plus, so 7 plus 1 whole bracket square, 7 plus 1 is 8 square, square of 4, 16 and square of 8 is 64. 16 plus 64 is equal to 80. Again, we cannot directly find the root of 80. So, we will make parts of 80 which are 16 5s. Now, root of 16 is 4 and root of 5 is under root 5. So, BC is equal to 4 root 5. In the same way, let us find AC. X1 is 2 and X3 is 0 y1 is 3 and y3 is minus 1. 2 minus 0, 2 minus minus plus, so 3 plus 1, 2 square plus 3 plus 1, 4 square, square of 2, 4 and square of 4, 16. So, AC square is equal to 20. Now, AC 20 means 4 5s are 
root of 4 2 and root of 5 under root 5. So, A c is equal to 2 root 5. Now, to find that these points are collinear points, we have to think that sum of two line segment is equal to the third line segment. So, here A b plus B c 2 root 5 plus 2 root 5 becomes 4 root 5. So, A b plus A c is equal to B c. Here A b plus A c is equal to B c. If sum of two line segments is equal to third line segment, then we can say that these points are collinear. So, points A, B and C are collinear points. So, friends, if you really think that this channel is useful to you, then please subscribe to this channel and learn maths with me in a very easy way. Thank you.